Pause the video and have a go at this question. So this question says, Leanne invests £2,500 for four years into a savings account. It increases in compound interest by 3% each year. So how much money does she have at the end of four years? So first of all, we're going to take the amount that we've got. So that's the capital amount, which is 2500 And then we're going to increase this by the 3%. So the percentage multiplier for 3% is times in by 1.03. So we're going to times by 1.03 here. OK, and we're increasing by four years. So we're going to do this to the power of four years. And we're literally just going to sling this straight into our calculator, which is going to say two thousand eight hundred and thirteen pounds. Now, because it's in pounds, we need to round to two decimal places. So this is 0.77. So hopefully that part of the video made sense. But I think some of you might be struggling with where this one point naught three comes from. So. Basically, if we start at 100% and I increase by 3%, this now becomes 103%. Okay, so if I want to turn 103% into a decimal, we must divide by 100 and this becomes 1.03. But because we're trying to increase this, we're going to be multiplying this and that's the percentage multiplier.